today, what happens when you need a wee? Well, come on, hit play. Cup of tea, Chris. Oh, I love a cup of tea. Is this for me? Yeah. Mmm. I made it specially. Mmm. That's delicious. Tea is my absolute favourite thing. Are you having one? No, no, all for you. Obviously, we wanted your bladder to be as full as possible, so you'd been absolutely pounding the water all morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been giving Chris lots of tea because I want to use his bladder to show you what happens when we empty it. I'm going to use an ultrasound so that we can see what Chris's bladder looks like now that it's full. Look at your square bladder. <laughs> I've got an enormous bladder, actually. I can pee a huge amount. Now, what you're looking at here, these top layers are Chris's tummy muscles, and then below <laughs> here, this big... <laughs> it's really good that it is all real. Mm. All this stuff, we never, you know... We, I we never fake anything. We could, we could fake it, couldn't we? We could record the thing if and then... If we say something there, is poo, it is poo. If, it is, if you say it's vomit, it is vomit. It's your real it's bladder real. full of real urine on the real screen. It's full of clear liquid, which is urine. Now, the reason Chris needs to go so badly is because the sensors in his bladder wall are detecting all the stretching, and this is known as the micturition reflex, the point at which you really, really have to go. You were genuinely I pretty was, close. I was going to have You were going to wear in your pants. I was gonna have you can see that in my face. Hold on, listen to yeah. this. I think pretty confidently I can say that I'm about to feel the micturition reflex. Oh, I drank, like, five, five or six cups of tea and a whole bottle of water. I mean, it, I was... It, I was in the right state. All right, go ahead then. What? Here in the lab? Just this once, on one occasion, you're allowed to pee in the lab, Chris. I think I'd better, because I don't think I'm going to make it to the toilet. Were you nervous? Do you remember being nervous? Because the room's, the room's full of people. There's probably 15 yeah, people in the room. I remember being very self-conscious. I'm going to hold the ultrasound scanner against my bladder while I'm weeing, so you can see it shrinking as I go to the loo. So this is a really good example of what you don't get to do when you're a doctor or at medical school, which is mess around with a scan. And we had had this idea filming the previous year's labs where we have an ultrasound machine oh, we yeah. were messing around yeah. with. OK, Chris, let your micturition reflex go. You don't normally pee in front of a big audience. And then I got nervous that I might get, you know, shy bladder and not be able to go. We can see on the ultrasound that Chris's bladder is shrinking, and that's because the muscle fibres are pressing on the bladder, forcing the wee out. God, that's great. I can't remember what I was weeing into. A bottle, a bucket? And you can't see his bladder anymore at all. Completely empty. So how much did you go? You want to see? Yeah. Wow. So how much is that? About a litre. I yeah. suspect that I was probably being annoying and going, no, no, adjust the probe, we've got to get a better view. Yeah, it was That's also it was true. a one-shot deal, you know, you can't it, you know, it takes an hour oh, to fill yeah. up the bladder like that. So it was it was we only got the one take. It's quite a lot. So the amazing thing is that my bladder's gone from being this size to so small that we can hardly see it on the ultrasound. And it's those muscle fibres in the bladder that force all the urine out. But be warned, if you hold in your wee for too long, the muscles in the bladder can weaken, making it harder for it to empty itself. That is really good, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, that was really good. That's why we have, I think, one of the best jobs in the world, is because we, we get to sort of discover new things ourselves and then show them to you. So when the call of nature comes, it's absolutely vital that you answer it. Look, Chris, I really feel like a cup of tea. 